Hi, welcome to umpatire.com, your number one online retailer for sports officials, gear, and apparel. This is your crew how to, how to properly install your wraparound umpire mass pads. I've got my Wilson black and gray wraparound pads here. I've already got the one side completed. Our goal with wraparound pads is to protect you from the frame of your mask when it rotates after being struck with a foul ball or just really a pass ball. You want to ensure that the pad wraps around the bar, hence wrap around pads. We're gonna get that bar deep in the crease of the, of the pad. I've already done my one side, so now I wanna tighten up this side, making sure to force that bar deep in the crease, see, deep in that crease, and bring that, bring that Velcro strap tight. This is gonna increase the amount of space that the pad is along your forehead. So more impact is gonna go into the pad rather than be transferred from the bars to your head. This is especially important on the Force 3 and the spring assembly. I've got one side kind of already done up, but I even want to tighten that up more. I'm going to undo that and just really bring that top pad and the bar down into, into the crease. Same thing on this side. Force 3 has got the outer shell bars, and then we have this inner shell bar, so it's going to go in there. Pull tight, get that down in there, and bring that Velcro all the way back, bringing the top pad out, and protecting you more from those springs. The springs are going to work great, but there's got to be some protection. So that brings this top pad out and more against your forehead. I've removed the mass uh, straps, the harness straps for the purpose of this video. You can see I've done the bottom pads the same, working those bars deep into the crease of the bottom of the, of the mass pads. Thank you guys. This has been your crew how-to on properly installing your wraparound pads.